Apple has just done something that no one saw coming. While everyone was still busy benchmarking the M4 chips, a massive leak from deep within the supply chain has just confirmed the existence of the M5 Mac Mini. And this isn't just a small spec bump. We're talking about a machine that is about to redefine what a desktop computer can actually do. If you thought the M4 redesign was the peak of the Mac Mini's evolution, you are in for a serious shock. Today, we are pulling back the curtain on everything Apple didn't want you to know yet. The raw power, the hidden thermal architecture, and why this tiny box might actually be more powerful than your current Mac Studio. For years, the Mac Mini was the underdog. It was the affordable entry point, the basic desktop. But something changed. Apple realized that they could cram a supercomputer into a footprint smaller than a lunchbox. And with the M5, they're taking that philosophy to an extreme. Imagine a chip built on a revolutionary 3 nanometer process that doesn't just run faster, but thinks faster. We're talking about the first true AI native desktop processor. The M5 isn't just about opening apps quickly. It's about a neural engine so advanced it can handle billions of operations per second without even breaking a sweat. But why now? Why is Apple pushing the M5 so soon? The answer lies in the competition. Windows laptops and desktops are finally catching up with Snapdragon and Intel's latest offerings. Apple knows they can't just be slightly better anymore. They have to be generations ahead. That's where the M5 Mac Mini comes in. It's a calculated move to dominate the creative market, the coding world, and even the gaming space, which has been Apple's Achilles heel for decades. Let's talk about the heart of this beast. The M5 chip architecture is rumored to feature a completely redesigned GPU. For the first time, we are looking at hardware-accelerated ray tracing that actually rivals dedicated graphics cards. This means video editors working in 8K or 3D artists rendering complex scenes in Blender will no longer feel the limitations of a small form factor. The thermal management inside this tiny chassis is where the real magic happens. Apple has reportedly developed a new composite material for the internal cooling system that allows the M5 to maintain peak performance for hours without thermal throttling. No more loud fans. No more heat waves on your desk. Just pure, silent power. And then there's the memory. The jump to unified memory was a game changer. But the M5 takes it a step further with increased bandwidth that literally eliminates the bottleneck between the CPU and GPU. Whether you're running local LLMs, training your own AI models, or just having 50 Chrome tabs open while editing a 4K timeline, the M5 Mac Mini treats it like a walk in the park. But it's not just about what's inside. It's about how it changes your workflow. The M5 Mac Mini is designed to be the hub of the modern workspace. With Thunderbolt 5 support likely making its debut, the data transfer speeds will be astronomical. Imagine backing up terabytes of footage in seconds or connecting multiple 6K Pro Display XDRs without a single flicker. This is the level of connectivity that was previously reserved only for the most expensive Mac Pros. Now, I know what you're thinking. Is it worth the wait? Should you skip the M4 and wait for this? Here is the reality that most tech reviewers won't tell you. Tech moves fast, but the jump from M4 to M5 represents one of the biggest architectural shifts since the transition from Intel to Apple Silicon. We are seeing a shift from performance-first to intelligence-first computing. The M5 is built specifically to handle the next decade of software, where AI isn't just a feature, but the foundation. Think about the value proposition here. You are getting the performance of a machine that would have cost $5,000 just three years ago, all starting at a price point that remains accessible. It's the smartest investment a professional can make in 2026. Apple is positioning the M5 Mac Mini not just as a computer, but as a statement. A statement that size no longer dictates power. But there is a catch. There's always a catch with Apple. Availability and the tiered pricing of the Pro and Max chips mean you have to be very careful about which configuration you choose. You don't want to overspend, but you also don't want to be left behind. The leak. S suggests that the base model will finally start with more storage and RAM as standard. B 
because Apple knows that 8 gigabytes or even 16 gigabytes just won't cut it in an AI-driven world. As we look closer at the leaked benchmarks, the numbers are staggering. We are seeing a 30% increase in multi-core performance over the M4. But the real story is in the GPU compute scores. The M5 is crushing everything in its class. It's not just a tool. It's a weapon for creators. If you are a coder, your compile times will vanish. If you are a photographer, your exports will be near instant. The M5 Mac Mini is the culmination of everything Apple has learned over the last five years of making their own silicon. It is refined, it is efficient, and it is terrifyingly fast. We are standing at the edge of a new era of personal computing. An era where your computer anticipates your needs, handles your heaviest workloads with ease, and disappears into your setup because it's so small and silent. So, as we wait for the official keynote, the message is clear. The M5 Mac Mini is coming, and it's going to change everything. It's the ultimate expression of what a Mac can be. Powerful, beautiful, and uncompromising. The question isn't whether you need it. The question is, how much faster could you be working if you had one on your desk right now? Stay tuned, because as more details emerge about the final launch date and the exact pricing tiers, you'll want to be the first to know. The era of the M5 is almost here, and it's going to be a wild ride. Don't settle for yesterday's tech when the future is just around the corner. This is more than just a computer. This is the M5 Mac Mini, and it is glorious that we are moving past the era of incremental updates. When you look at the architecture of the M5 chip, you realize Apple is no longer just competing with Intel or AMD. They are competing with the future of cloud computing. The integration of neural accelerators into every single GPU core of the M5 is a move that changes the game for local processing. In the past, if you wanted to run a massive AI model or render a complex 3D animation, you had to rely on a server farm or a machine that costs as much as a small car. Now, that power is sitting on your desk, pulling less power than a light bulb. Let's talk numbers, because the benchmarks we are seeing for the M5 Mac Mini are nothing short of predatory. Early leaks suggest a 15% jump in single-core performance. But the multi-core scores are where the M5 truly starts to flex. We are looking at a nearly 25% increase over the M4. For a professional editor, that is the difference between waiting for a render and seeing it happen in real time. But the most shocking statistic is the AI compute performance. Apple is claiming up to four times the peak GPU compute for AI tasks compared to the M4. If you're using apps like Topaz Video AI, Adobe Premiere's AI tools, or running local LLMs, the M5 isn't just faster, it's in a different dimension. The memory story is also evolving. For the first time, we're seeing the base model unified memory bandwidth hit 153 gigabytes per second. That is a 30% increase. Why does this matter? Because in a unified architecture, the faster your memory can talk to your chip, the less lag you experience in high-demand tasks. It means the M5 Mac Mini can handle 8K video streams and massive datasets with a fluidity that was previously impossible in this form factor. And for the gamers, yes, Apple is finally taking you seriously. With third-generation ray tracing and a 45% graphics uplift, the M5 Mac Mini is becoming a legitimate gaming console. We are seeing AAA titles like Cyberpunk 2077 finally running on Mac with playable frame rates and stunning visuals. This tiny box is now capable of doing what high-end PCs were struggling to do just a couple of years ago. It's no longer a work-only machine. It's a total entertainment powerhouse. But let's look at the strategic timing. Apple is reportedly planning to launch the M5 Mac Mini around WWDC 2026. This isn't a coincidence. They want to pair this hardware launch with massive updates to Mac OS that lean heavily into Apple intelligence. They are building the hardware to match the software of tomorrow. If you buy an M5 Mac Mini, you aren't just buying a computer for 2026. You are buying a machine that is architecturally prepared for the next decade of AI evolution. The design is expected to remain the same as the 2024 redesign, and that's a good thing. Why fix what isn't broken? 
The ultra-compact footprint with front-facing ports and the internal power supply is already the gold standard for desktop design. But under that sleek aluminum shell, the M5 is a different beast entirely. It's more efficient, it's cooler, and it's significantly more capable. The competition is sweating. Windows manufacturers are trying to catch up with NPU-focused chips, but Apple's vertical integration gives them a massive lead. When the hardware, the silicon, and the operating system are all designed by the same team, you get a level of optimization that no other company can match. The M5 Mac Mini is the ultimate proof of that advantage. So, here is the bottom line. The M5 Mac Mini is the most important desktop Apple has ever made. It bridges the gap between the casual user and the extreme professional. It takes the Mini out of the performance equation and leaves only the power. Whether you're a creative professional, a developer, or someone who just wants the best technology available, the M5 is the answer. It is the peak of Apple Silicon, a masterpiece of engineering, and the new king of the desktop. The future isn't coming. It's already here, and it fits in the palm of your hand. This is the machine that will define the next five years of your digital life. Don't just watch the revolution happen. Own it. The M5 Mac Mini is waiting. And once you experience this level of power, there's no going back. Prepare yourself, because your desk is about to get a lot more powerful.